AJ struggles started about a year ago with what he thought was the flu. And we found out that he had AML, leukemia. I just wiped us out. We couldn't believe it. First treatments went well, and then the cancer came back with a vengeance. Doctors giving him one month to find a bone marrow donor. As soon as possible, you think you've got a little time, and um, we don't. So as you saw, AJ needs a lot of our help. That's why we are getting the story out there. Get as much publicity as possible for him so he can find that donor. You know, we talked about the story this morning, morning and how easy it is to become a bone marrow donor. All you have to do is get a quick swab of your mouth and you can see if you're a match or not. And I found some t statistics online that I thought were really startling. This year, more than 130,000 Americans will be diagnosed with a serious blood disease. Of those 130,000 Americans, only 30% of patients who need a bone marrow transplant have a matching donor in their families. So the remaining 70% must hope that a compatible stranger can be found using the National Registry. However, only 2% of Americans use the National Registry. And you can register by going to bethematch.org and maybe you can help someone out there that needs a transplant. He said, Aunt Michelle, if you can't find one for me, find a match for somebody so that's why we're doing this as you can see aj needs a lot of our help he's just 18 years old a student at ucf if you would like to help him out first you can share this post right now and then you can go to the saint cloud gold's gym that's on 13th street at five o'clock tonight there you can see if you're a match and if you are maybe you can help him out i'll see you tomorrow at 5 a.m